Hello all, this is Poovili from Informatica Support. This video is regarding the steps of upgradation of power center from 10.5.2 to 10.5.4. This is actually a hotfix application. We will also see the rollback steps followed by. The agenda of this video is understanding what is hotfix application and the rollback, what are the prerequisites and followed by a demo. Hotfix application is actually a backing up your existing directories, applying any new version of the product and restoring or updating any required configuration. So it involves installation process as set of regular upgrade, but it is typically faster and less disruptive. Rollback application typically includes reverting to a previous state by undoing any changes made during the hotfix installation. So whenever you are rollbacking a hotfix, the installer restores the Informatica to the previously installed versions. The prerequisites are, it is only applicable to apply on top of its major base version. For example, you can apply a hotfix on base of 10.5, 10.5.1, 10.5.2, 10.5.3 10 for this 10.5.4 hotfix. Before you apply or roll back the hotfix, ensure that you shut down the domain and for a multi-node configuration, you also need to shut down all the nodes. Also, for a multi-node setup, you have to apply the hotfix on each node individually. Take a backup of node.meta.xml, odbc.ini file and also the site keys. And set all the environment variables before performing this activity. And before applying hotfix, it is always recommended to take a backup of your domain repository and all the application services. There is no need of new directory or no need of new license needed for this hotfix application. We'll quickly jump into the demo. So here, I already have 10.5.2 version. Let's check that. So from version.txt, we are confirming that the existing version is 10.5.2. Now I'm going to apply a hotfix on top of this 10.5.2 with the version of 10.5.4. I have, I have already installed the installation file. See, I have extracted this installation file. Now we have to run the install script. Yes, continue. So here we have to choose fifth option that is apply the hotfix to the version. So I'm going with five. It is asking whether we have to apply the hotfix or rollbacking the hotfix. So we are going for one. Agree to terms and conditions. Click enter to continue. Here we have to give the existing 10.5.2 that is the base version directory. So I am giving I am choosing sandbox environment. This is actually a distributive packages. I'm not going for it. So it will show a warning as shut down the Informatica domain. I have already shut down that. So click enter. It is showing available disk space and required disk space, the prerequisites. So click enter. It is getting installed. So here our installation got successful. This hotfix installation status is success now. We can also check from the log provided. So we'll check in logs now. So it got created just to get on that. So it says hotfix installation is success. 
will meanwhile check in version dot txt also. Now it should have updated with ten dot five dot four. So it got updated. This is the steps for up, up, applying the hotfix. We'll quickly go for rollback also. So here, whenever we are applying the hotfix, we will be getting created with this one folder back back from whatever the hotfix applied. So while applying rollback, that will get all these ten five two binaries from this backup folder. Let's see how we are going to perform rollback steps also. Again, we have to run the same install dot sh file. Yes. Choose five. So here we have to choose whether hotfix application or rollback. I am going for rollback. Agree to terms and conditions. Press enter. The same installation directory of ten five two. Press enter. Continue. Rollback is applied. So now rollback has also completed successfully. Let's check whether version dot txt file has been updated. You can also check uh, from the logs for the rollback. See, it has rolled back again to ten five two. and we could not see that backup folder right because it got all the binaries back when we applied this rollback these are the steps for applying hotfix and rollback we would love to hear from you you can provide your valuable feedbacks at supportvideos@informatica.com or the address twitter thanks for watching this video